Hi, I just finished setting up my new network storage system. It was easy too. Let me show you how I did it. For the installation, all I needed was a NAS 200 storage system, a router, and a couple of disk drives. The storage system doesn't come with pre-installed disk drives. I bought them separately so I could choose the amount of storage that's right for me. I'm using two new 500 gigabyte hard drives, which will store my music, video, and data files well into the future. To install a hard drive, push together the clips on the drive bay door and remove it. Lift the plastic ribbon and insert the hard drive. Make sure it's snug. And then close the disk drive door. Do the same thing for the second drive. An Ethernet cable is included in the box. I connected one end to the Ethernet port on my NAS 200. The other end I connected to a port on my router. Next, I plugged in the power cable and pressed the power button on the back panel. At first, the power LED flashes while booting up. When you hear two beeps, it's done. The power and Ethernet LEDs should be lit, as well as one LED for each installed hard drive. Linksys provides a Setup Wizard CD. All I had to do was insert the CD into my PC and follow the directions. The Setup Wizard runs automatically. This is the welcome screen. I just had to fill in some information and make a few choices. On this next screen, I need to confirm that I want to format my drives, which will erase any data on them. My drives are new, so I don't need to worry about losing data. I'll go ahead and click OK to confirm. I'm done. Now I'm ready to store all those family photos, music files, and digital videos that I've been keeping all over the place. The storage system is always on, so I can get to it from any computer on my network. I don't need to have a PC dedicated to it. Another nice feature of the NAS 200 is the one-touch backup. This button on the front will begin my pre-programmed backup job. That's all. Wasn't that easy?